Hey guys, welcome to another Recollections Mini Plan With Me. Today I'm going to be doing the week of the 22nd through the, nope, the 23rd through the 29th of August. I don't know why I said 22nd. That's the week that we're currently in. Um, but the 23rd through the 29th. So this is the way that last week ended up. I truly just love this, uh, I, the flowers. I would love to have this type of stuff in my house. You know, like pictures and stuff. It's just so pretty. So I just really loved it. It was very joyful happy something to look at this this week it's not happy that the september keeps trying to come off i wonder if i need to get my glue um thing and put on there so let me flip to the page i have put this there to keep my page because this is what i use to mark my planner um for the week and i do not have any date dots out for this planner but I do have some date dots out. I haven't chosen any is what I'm trying to say. Maybe I'll use these. Because I have them right there. So, and I do have the right one. So the 23rd through the 29th. Yes, I have them. These are from, they're like a leftover from So Cute Planner. And I'm going to be using the same book that I used in my happy planner oh my goodness i've gotten both of those crooked already maybe i need to stop just right now the other video was a mess because i kept messing up and i kept having to look for stickers and i don't know the book i don't know any of the books because i don't take time to remember take i don't i'm, I'm talking real southern now I actually do talk like that sometimes. I'm not making fun of Southern people because I have been Southern my whole entire life. <laughs> I'm going to just turn it sideways. It's just going to be easier on me and you both. And I hate that I messed that up because now the three, some of the ink came off. The two, two. Okay, that's better. Anyway, I'm not making fun of Southern people or their accents. Because, honestly, my accent has gone, I don't know, it's according to what kind of mood I'm in, how, how country it gets. Like, it, it's according to, you know, like if I'm angry or happy or, also, I think it has something to do, like, whenever I'm around my actual family that doesn't live with me. Because I think almost all of them have more of a country twang or whatever. Or country whatever. I don't know what you call it. Something has happened to me since I moved to the city. My accent is different. And a lot of times I don't like it. Because I don't know. It's, it's not that I'm too... I'm not uppity or anything, which Jeff tells me all the time that I've gotten uppity since he met me. <laughs> I told him it was his fault. But anyway, <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and white out that notes part because I don't use that. The only thing I do over here is a habit tracker to check my comments every day because sometimes YouTube hides my comments. And this is my YouTube planner. So, that is what this is for. I don't use this box for anything else other than decoration. So, got that part out. I finally did something right today. Um, <laughs> I'm telling you, the other Happy Planner video was a, a wreck. It was a wreck and a half. It was a mess. I am going to go ahead and put down these little headers. I know they're not like to-dos or anything like that. 
but they are pretty and I don't put a lot of decoration in this part of the planner because I use that area I mean I do put decoration but not a lot because I use that area to write and I guess I'm just going to turn my planner sideways but as I was saying about my accent since I moved to the city I guess from being around so many different people and we actually live in a military college town it's like military and college here um, and there's two Air Force bases here and there's people from all over because of that because the fact that they're you know stationed here and being around them talking to them you you just pick it up you you pick up the way they talk the way that they you know whenever you're around them and living in a city where we live i just i, I lost my southern twang part of it not all of it because y'all know y'all know i'm from the south but sometimes it's like what happened and i also um my vocabulary is different because I read a lot and that has nothing to do with anything but reading and um you know Jeff has a suit I mean, he hasn't lost any of his accent I don't know how he hasn't I don't know how I have I don't know what it is am I one of those what do they call those those people that just pick up whatever other people or how they talk. I don't do it on purpose. I'm not trying to not be me, if that makes sense. I'm still trying to be me, but I'm, I'm just, I don't know. I, I just don't know. But I, if I'm around someone, I pick up their accent somehow at times. Like if I'm around them a lot. But neither one of our children seem to have much of a southern accent, and that kind of bothers me. <laughs> I mean, you can tell they're from the south, but you can tell, but it's just a little different. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and start decorating, and I think what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to grab these flowers right here. I know you can't see it, and I haven't even shown you the book. And I don't know if you're going to see the haul yet before or after this video or before or after the classic happy planner video. But I got this from Michaels and it's uh, the Planner's Anonymous book. But, um, okay, I'm going to grab my tweezers. I need to learn, learn, learn. Grab your tweezers whenever you start to do this because these stickers want to do their own thing before you're ready. And I actually was trying to put that in a way that it would not go over, but it still did a little bit. But it's only the clear part, so it's not even a big deal. I'm not even going to worry about it. I'm just going to snip it off and leave those scissors there in case I do that again. So I'm going to put that flower there. And then, which there are people that um, are not from the South that have lived here for a long time and they've picked up the the way you know the dialect or whatever you want to call it whatever the what is it called is it dialect is it i don't know i just don't know okay so i use that washi on the top i think i may use some of this across the middle I don't know why I'm using this across the middle I don't normally use what did I do with it again oh it's right there hello as they say if it had been a snake it would bit me I don't remember where I got this washi from I think it was in a box from Amazon with um, some more washi that I have. I'm not sure though. I think that's where it came from. A long time ago. 
I need to put some little uh what are those things called these are too big I mean they wouldn't be but I put that washi there some checklists let's see I made that spot I don't know let's see half of that'll work if it doesn't I may take the washi up I don't know I think it's I think it might be okay but oh no it's not because that's not gonna stick to the washi okay so what will I do with this washi now I guess I can put it back on the roll after I'm done I can use it some other time because it'll fit up there I'll just use it again later if I remember I'll use it in this planner that's a good thing about washi it is forgiving to a, a certain extent but I didn't think about the fact that I had not put any kind of checklist down and I need my checklist why I don't know I could just write in the box but the checklist even though I don't use them the way checklists are supposed to be used by checking them off most of the time the checklist keep they'll how does it how do I explain it they keep me in line I guess I don't know okay these stickers are not being very good to me they just don't want to come up I'm not sure why that's happening okay so I do not want to put this color up here so I'm gonna put it down here I know that may sound weird but Okay, so I don't want to put those that one there either so it's got to be one of these so I will put this one here and the yellow one here okay now I'm gonna flip back over here to these decorative stickers and I'm going to grab some of the decorative the flowers and things this book is not cut properly it's just not and I don't want to complain I hate complaining but it's upsetting whenever you can't get your stickers up and you're not doing anything wrong. You know what I mean? It's like, what do you do? Do you, do you just grin and bear it? <laughs> yes, that's what you do. You grin and bear it. But there are so many spots that are not cut on here. Put that there. Put a couple of flowers down. Put one here. I felt like something was on me. You know, I think the other video, the classic Happy Planner one, I think it started going down, downhill whenever the bug started attacking my planner and I accidentally killed it on my planner page. It was embarrassing. It was embarrassing because, I mean, there were blood guts. <laughs> it wasn't that gross. <laughs> but, yeah. It was upsetting that that bug, and I know you shouldn't be upset about something like that. Because, you know, it's part of life. It's just the way things go sometimes. Okay, this one right here, since it's so... 
Okay, hold on. I don't want to. Okay, I'm gonna stick you there just because I don't want to put. I want to put a. I want to put a leaf there. Anyway, what was I saying? Okay, it, it's just part of life that things. Oh my goodness, that things just don't go right. This thing is so messed up. This book is not cut properly at all. I'm going to just stick that like that, I think. I don't know. I don't really like it. But I kind of, I did, I did find myself being embarrassed whenever that happened, which I don't, I didn't say anything like that. I didn't say I was embarrassed, but I did get embarrassed when that bug attacked my planner page and I killed it on accident and it was gross to me and I don't know it just was it was gross and that whole plan plan with me ended up being way longer because the stickers just like this they won't come up they're not doing what they should be doing it's a brand new book they should be doing what they should be doing what they're supposed to be doing but they're just not they're not coming up but that's okay and I will just make them come up I will use my fingernails and I will get them up oh, I don't want a purple over there I'll put that one there I don't know why I'm putting these little flowers down like this other than they're just cute I didn't really plan to do it it just started happening <laughs> It just started happening. I don't know why. I didn't even use any of these bows. I was going to put a quote or something in there, and I haven't done that yet. But yeah, I was a little bit embarrassed by the crazy bug thing. I didn't say anything, though. Now you know. Now if you watch this one and that one, you know. You know. You know and I know. We all know. I'm talking crazy. I feel crazy. Sometimes I say that, you know, I think, oh, I shouldn't say stuff like that because there are people who are labeled as crazy, which that label is ridiculous sometimes. But I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't say it. I'm going to just put this here because I'm not going to try to put it back in a thing and it won't work there. But I want something there because I'm not going to decorate anything in this part. I think I went too wild. Did I go too wild? I want some sort of quote or something. I don't know if there are any quotes that are clear background. I don't think there are. As I said, I don't know the book that well. Oh, there we go. We can get these. Um, it says so many beautiful days ahead could put it here. Do I want to put it there? I don't want to put it over the... Okay. Let's just hope I don't ruin this by doing this. Okay, I'm doing that. And... Can I pull you up? Are you down forever? You are down forever. Okay. No, I don't want you to go down yet. Wait. Oh, goodness. Okay, let me put that down like that. 
I want to get it right up against that. Yay! Yes. Okay, that's what I wanted. Yay! Okay. I think I'm done. I think I am done, done, done. Done, done, done. I think it's cute. I think it's cute. I think it's not overly done, but it's not underdone. You know, we don't want underdone things. And... Yeah, looking at it on camera it looks better than what I thought it would. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, go ahead and hit the like button. If you like my channel, go ahead and subscribe and hit the bell so you're notified whenever I upload. I would say that, you know, maybe I will get better next week with my crazy talks and thoughts and all the things I say, but... I'm me, and I, I doubt it. I mean, I seriously doubt it. I'm just who I am, and I, I seem to talk crazy. <laughs> Even in my own opinion, it's a little crazy. Like, whenever I'm editing these videos, I'm like, oh my goodness, why did I say that? But, you know, it's me. It's who I am. I'm trying to put this washi back on here, but it may not work. You can't even see that. But you may be able to hear it. But anyways, that's how the week is going to look. I do think it's adorable. You guys that have been with me from the other channel know that I love florals. At least you should. At least I think you should. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I have not said it enough, but I'm saying it now. <laughs> I love florals. And I love, like, butterflies and, you know, just critters that are not alive and on my face <laughs> like that bug was trying to be that I accidentally murdered I shouldn't say that on YouTube that I murdered something because somebody might think I'm talking about a human but it was a bug I promise I have proof it's on film <laughs> or it's on a digital recording <laughs> if you can't laugh at yourself who can you laugh at <laughs> wait that's not right Alright, I'm going to go. Thank you guys so much for watching. No, I am not on drugs. And I will see you next time. <laughs> don't forget. Oh my goodness. I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> Remember, don't take any wooden nickels. And be sweet.